up guys it's your boy Dean Charlie and I'm back again with another video and the lighting in this car is terrible but y'all probably like didn't you just record a video in this car yes yes I did um gosh go check it out uh, yeah well this is a review about my nose ring that I got um so well I had it for a month now I haven't changed it like, I had it for over a month now. They said like four months to help, but like, you could change it sooner than that. But like, these are a bitch to get out because this is a corkscrew and not a hoop. I wonder if a hoop or a loop would have been harder to get out. Probably wouldn't have been. But I wouldn't walk around with that because what if I don't like it? Like, I like the stud. Um. So, uh, Let's just be, I'm just going to be honest, bluntly honest with you. Um, I have tugged on my nose ring by accident. Like, it's been stuck in a pillow. Uh, like, that was a bitch. I don't know how the hell, like, it got pulled down from a, by a pillow. And it got pulled up from the pillow. Oh, my God. And then recently, like, I you forget that you have it. And I get in the shower, like, after I get out the shower or whatever. I use my towel to dry my face i didn't pat i should have pat instead of drag because i dra drag drag it, it will lead to wrinkles pats you know it keeps the wrinkles away and it will also keep you from pulling your nose ring out my nose ring went like Phew. but it didn't come out if it came out i would have replaced it with the ones that i got for this website for cheap not for cheap well for a good price they're actually decent ones I don't know if I have them actually. I know I showed them in the last video I had before that I did. Yeah, I have them there and there. Uh, not the last video I did, but the video I did before that, or maybe the video I did before that video. I don't know. You guys are gonna have to go check out my videos if y'all really care to see what they look like. If you don't, that's fine by me. Um, I told you guys I was gonna upload more content, and this is what I'm doing. Um, yeah. And my boyfriend, he's been busy lately, so he might make a appearance out of nowhere on here or in our next vlog or whatever because he's doing drag now or starting to do drag now. So, and he's actually pretty good with the makeup, you know, with the makeup. <laughs> what the fuck why do i sound old like i talk like like i sound like an old person like you know how like, turn that oh no with like with the makeup that to pull, like, the facebook like the the like why is there a need for that the to be there like oh my god um any who's or anyways um yeah and he's actually been good. Yeah, like he uh, did a. I know he followed the tutorial, but like he did it, his blending from over FaceTime. Look, bomb. But you know, FaceTime be it be playing with you. But then he sent me a picture, and it looked fine. So, um, yeah. So when he starts doing that, I, you guys will see. I guess that's how you guys will see more of him. I guess I don't know. Well, stay tuned for any of you videos in the future. I was about to say something totally different. I don't know why. I was about to say any visions in the future. I'm not psychic, but you know, you get that like that little psychic little vibe. You know, I get that sometimes. You know, it's like or deja vu or whatever. I'd be like, mm hmm. It's that intuition, you know. Not only females have it, men have it too. It has nothing to do with that. Okay, neither. Okay. I guess men will call it well straight men call it a hunch you know females call it an intuition bitch is an intuition hunch okay <laughs> i don't know what to tell you um this starbucks tea right here is mama shit all of my motherfucking video like this person has been watching me from over there Now they're leaving. Anywho. Pride is coming up. Oh my god. DC Capital Pride. Hey. Um gonna be there for only like the parade and the concert. I want tickets to this uh 
Riot thing. Mm. They have yet to email me my tickets. They tell me you get an email. What email? This was month, a month ago. Yeah, a month ago. This is before I got my nose ring done. And I still ain't got no email. But it's all right. I didn't pay for anything. It was free. But I won a contest. Like, you know, when you win something, you want it. Like, you're just like, where is it at, though? Like, where is it? I want it. 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 Like, uh. But that's okay because the next day we're doing uh, this drag rival. If you guys are in the DMV area, I know I'm not in the show, or whatever. My boyfriend's not in the show. I don't do drag. So, of course, I wouldn't be in the show. But it's hosted by Dee Dee Darion. It's in Baltimore. It's at the Revival Hotel. I think that's what's called. I, I honestly, I I go. It's fun as shit. Uh, it's like thirty five dollars. I think it's thirty two, thirty five, something somewhere in that area. Thirty one to thirty five dollars for the for the dinner and the show. And you can tip them. And like Didi said, they all take Venmo, uh, PayPal, Cash App, uh, whatever else. I, I forgot. I think PayPal too. I think I probably said that. <laughs> um, the food, yeah, the food, actually, the food there is actually good. Um, and then they have like this $15 Bellini. My boyfriend gets it all the time. It's that it's not like the drink is not fifteen dollars itself. It's for bottomless Bellinis for fifteen dollars. So yeah, your price would be like fifty or fifty five bucks, you know. But it's worth it. The show's amazing. I have to say, I have a I have a couple few that I like. Obviously, Didi, um, Venus, Frustrata. Um, there's this new drag queen. Her name is Lady Lightbright. I like her. I like her. And I like Hazel Darion, too. She, okay, when I first saw her, I didn't, I wasn't really, like, you know, into her because I felt like she wasn't, give, I feel like she could have gave more. And as the months went on, Bitch, surprise me! She, her, her shit has gotten better. She does Hannah on Montana music too. Mm, uh, that's like, you know, I gotta sing along with that. Like, that's my generation. I love that. And I think she's around my age, so that make a lot of sense. Um, who else? Baby. She does, I guess, a lot of lady. She does a lot of lady Gaga, and it it suits her. It fits her like. I guess because she can do the, like the, I guess the sexual thing or whatever. It's good. Well, you guys have to go check it out. I, there's probably YouTube videos on it, maybe. Like, I'm just over here promoting shows. I mean, cons yeah, shows. I'm not getting paid to do anything. I'm just doing it because, like, I have fun. I want you guys to have fun, especially if you're in the DMV area. But if you're in Virginia, that's a long-ass drive to Baltimore. But it's worth it though. Not going home though, but it's worth it though going up there. Anyways, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to this video. I mean, subscribe to my channel. Not subscribe to the video. That's not even possible. And don't forget to turn on your notification. You know, the little bell, that thing, the thing that's over there, or maybe it's over there. I don't know. Okay. It's out. Yeah. Bye.